Medley, listen carefully to what I'm about to tell you. The temple ahead is a nest of evil creatures, which is a typo. The same creature th Let's try that again. <laughs> the temple ahead is the nest of an evil creature, the same creature that stole the life of your predecessor, the sage. It is a dark and frightening place. That is why, if you do nothing else, then at least do this. If Link comes near you and presses R, be silent and follow closely behind him. Like any good wife. <laughs> and if Link presses A, allow him to pick up you pick you up. And if need be, fly and carry him through the air. And Link. Don't ask for sandwiches too much. If Medley gets stuck and cannot continue in the temple because she's not intelligent, use the Wind Waker to tell her what to do with the song that you learned. Do you understand? <laughs> Link, protect Medley, and Medley, protect Link. The power to repel evil shall surely be returned to the Master Sword. We could not finish Link's bow because it was too atrocious. We, it must be censored. Also, hey guys and gals, I'm Pal. And I'm Nova. And welcome back to Pal's Play Wind Waker. Last time! What did we do last time? We got a bunch of fairy islands and... We picked up Medley. Yeah, and that's, like, it. That's pretty much it. And this I time... I guess you could say that Link really knows how to pick up chicks. I used that one. You did? Yeah. Aw. Anyway, and this time we're going to be playing a song. Right here. Go ahead and play it. Now, while this happens, I would like to just real quick state that I am feeling a bit under the weather, and because of that, I will not be as strenuous my, with my voice, so if I sound different, then that's why. I just wanted to get a an episode recorded so that I didn't have to break the schedule. And bada bing, bada. Boom. Done and done. Let's go in. And not control this part. Swirly. Earth Temple. Swirly. Very strange name. It's cultural, I guess. Also, I would like to state that Nova is in control, and she will be for the entire dungeon. This is her favorite part in the game, so who am I to stand in the way of her having fun? Exactly. I'm glad you feel that way. But it comes with a drawback for her. During the Wind Temple, the other temple, which is to the north, I will be in control because it is sort of my favorite temple. Mr. Fairy- oh, sorry. Mr. Fairy, try holding Medley. Did he put a heart in there, too? Yeah. Whenever he refers to Medley, he puts a heart in there. Okay. Alright, how how do you want me to do this? Can I do my favorite stealth mode approach, or sure. do you want me to get through it quickly? Well, I mean, if your stealth mode approach it takes like 40 years, then don't do it. You want to try that glitch? Oh, yeah, yeah, go shoot him. Go shoot one of them. That guy. Shoot him. Shoot him. Actually, wait until he gets on solid ground. And then immediately pick him up. Ready? Shoot him. Okay, now pick him up. Pick him up. Come on. It, it won't let me. There we go. Good. Now just hold him. Just hold him. That's it. Oh man! Didn't work. Okay, kill him. Okay, I've seen glitch videos. That's a new attack. I've seen glitch videos where um, moblins have been picked up like that before, and then they just continue to float above Link's head, trying to attack him. I don't know how that worked, but... Actually, I think Link needs to be hit while holding it. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. So your stealth approach requires shooting exploding arrows. Yeah. Got it. See, the, the thing is, they're so stupid, they don't even notice. So it still qualifies as stealth mode. They are pretty stupid. Man, I'm too high up to be able to just ruin your plans and bomb them. How is this your stealth approach? Oh, we 
He looked at me for a second. He was like, hey, man, why do you have to shoot me with arrows? That's not cool. Also, I just realized both colors of Moblins are in here. Yeah. That's interesting to me. Is there any difference that you've noticed between them? Um, I think the blue ones live longer. Like, they can take longer, or they can take more hits before dying. Okay. Actually, no, wait. I think I remember the difference. Um, red ones always hold torches. Well, that too. But I, is, I was talking about differences that matter. Which is a f <laughs> that matter, which is kind of a funny, a funny thing. They're like, oh hey Bobby, uh, you're red, so you get to carry the lantern. It's like okay, thank you. Your only red moblins get the lantern. Thank you. But can I get a spear? No, you get the lantern. Okay. That's what I imagine going down. Okay. Why, if it isn't medley? Can you make that? I think she's supposed to take us to the first one. Can she really? Wow. Medley. Mr. Fairy is over here, as is Medley. You must command her to, as best you can. Where's Tingle? What? 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 Did he just ask where he himself was? Yes. Well, Link, I'm not very confident, but I think I should try to fly. I'll fly where you tell me to, just tap A to keep me airborne. Whenever you're ready, just use the wind waker to guide me. <laughs> I told you guys I wasn't going to be strenuous with my, with my voices, so I'm just going to be obscenely lax with them. You didn't see that. No, I didn't. You're right. Now, viewers, no one can't hear me right now. Should I bomb Medley mid-flight? Oh, snap. Should I? Should I? Tingle will spare you for now. Now, jump down. Tingle's tired of sparing you. Oh, really? <laughs> really? You are done anyway. That's just how Tingle works. Uh, you want those skull necklaces. True. Although they're not the, uh, the feathers. Yeah, the golden feathers that we need desperately for a quest, but, eh, whatever. Really? I told you I like the bow. Apparently you didn't you believe like me. I you like too much. I don't think you, okay. Yeah, L let's just go. We've spent too much time in this room, and it's frankly boring me. Let's go. Because your entertainment is all that matters. <laughs> exactly. Ooh, this room. I forgot about this room. Now, with this room comes the introduction of a new type of chew. We've talked about bl uh, blue, yellow, green, and red. But do you recall the most strong chew chew of all? Oh. We have the purple chew. He is right over here. He is immune to everything. Pal, even can you not? No. Though he's not immune to light. Come on, spin. All you have to spin. do is bring him out in a shiny day. And if you will hit him. Oh, did you see that? He'll be boo and it is cool. Okay, go ahead. Can you, yeah, kill him. I kind of want to show off the purple chews because they're my favorite. I don't understand why. Because they're unique. No other chew is unique. So yeah, they'll turn into statues. That's the only way to kill them. And you have to throw the chews. Preferably add another chew because it that just that's just precious. Wait for him to come up and... Be, uh, what? He fell short. Or he fell short. Let's try that again. Take two is... Never mind. It pushed him. It didn't okay. hit him. I would think that that would hurt him, but maybe not. Look this way. So the mechanic of this dungeon is right here, as you can see, light. Um, because the start dungeon is dark, light shining in has an added effect because you can see it. So with medley, that instrument isn't just for good looks; it actually serves a purpose. It can materialize things somehow. Yeah, we're not going to explain how. Because we though can't. I would like an explanation from Tingle. 
Why, if it isn't Medley? That's what he says every single time he sees her. <laughs> oh, look at that. A woman who doesn't know any better. I think Tingle has short-term memory loss. Yeah. I mean, if he forgot who Tingle was, and he's Tingle, that's the problem. Oh, uh, you want to burn that pot? Or can I just blow that up? You can blow it up if you want. I can't find it. There it is. There we go. Oh, we got a pot from it. I didn't expect that to work, honestly. Come here. I'm just gonna be like this, creeping above you. Now, if Link were to look up and see Tingle <laughs> doing this... See Tingle doing this... <laughs> that'd look pretty funny. And, and if I turn up the Game Boy, you can hear that Tingle's constantly saying, Yeah? And it's precious. Okay, what do we do in this room? We don't have a key. I'm gonna try it. Okay. Okay, that fog makes you... Let's see, does it reverse the controls or make you lose con ability to use items? Uh, ability to use items. Okay. Oh, drat. That, th that stuff comes back. You might need to use the medley. Wait a minute. How can I... Oh, wow! Do that it actually again, do gets it again. rid of it. Ready, set, go. Wait. Hit it, hit it. Okay, it's you used too the fast. Wrong, you used the wrong item. Oh, I did. Yeah. Okay, you ready? Hold on, let me line up. Let me get right here. Ready, set, go. go. You went too early. <sighs> Just go as soon as you see the bomb. This Hold costs on. way let too much money. Hold on. Are you ready? Ready. Wait, I'm going to do that. There. Ready, set, go. Why'd you do that? Nice! Nailed it! Ha! It only cost 30 rupees! Good job! Also, Link has like the most stoned expression on his face. Wait, I have to do that again. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Purple flamingos and mannequins and eyeballs in the you sky. You wanna see something funny? Look at this. I wanna see you go through the door. Honestly. Hold on a second. Zoom in. Doesn't do anything. Okay, let's let's go through the door. And light cures that disease, by the way. The, the, how you're supposed to do it is you just medley to shine onto the statue's eyes, which will just get rid of the fog. But oh snap, oh, this room. Well, they're not they're not re dead, so we're good. And when, just when he made a sand, I got stuck in a coffin. Eek, Mr. Fairy. Come to me, please, sir. Help me. Yeah, right, Tingle. Is that necessary? Hi. Mr. Fairy over here. Here, hurry. Tingle is actually pretty useless. Could you help me? I'm in the coffin. Thank you. Oh, phew. We're okay. Ganondorf the Evil One is coming for poor Tingle at last. Are you hurt, Traveler? I hope not. This is for you. Thanks for saving me. He gave you a rupee. He gave you a rupee, in case you want to get it. Eh, I'm fine. And apparently Tingle doesn't know what a, so what a coffin is, because he, he keeps saying that there's a solid object there. There's a lot of things that Tingle doesn't know. Apparently Tingle just sees in terms of solid object and not solid object. I do like that they returned the mechanic of having a companion. Okay, now if I recall correctly, uh, you spawning that chest will cause an enemy to spawn. Yep. I know, I it know. It seems like the I'm trying to reflect light. This can help, I think. Instruct me to where to reflect the light and use A to face my instrument in that direction. Use the wind waker to guide me, okay? That's how Link hears her. I think. I can aim her without using the Wind Waker. Hey, just look at right here, right here, right there. No, she's not. She's not catching on. See, this would have been an excellent opportunity for a second player. Yeah, it would. But also, games with optional second players are kind of weird, to be honest. Mm. You know? No. No game does that. Because it would be kind of unfair. It's like, hey, guys, this game's second player, but only in this level. You can't do second two player or any other place. It would be fun anyway. 
Okay, I'm pretty sure an enemy will spawn now. Yeah, it will. I'm gonna That's get in position to bomb it. You can stay here. And we got a key! Okay, I'm I was in gonna be a joy pendant for a second. I'm in that position. That would not be worth. I'm in position to bomb the, the enemy. There he is. Oh. I've spotted a floor master. It's quick, but your sword can destroy it. Okay, I'm here. Oh, this is the one that jumps out. Come here. Oh, yeah, this guy doesn't bother you. Oh, oh I, yeah, he does. Really? Okay, guys, we're back. That threw us out uh, in the main hall. So what I'm thinking is that, well, first of all, you can... Did I get him? Dodge. I got him. Sweet. Okay, well, I guess I guess she did a... Nova, you did a good job of avoiding those enemies. I thought we were going to have to fight him, but okay. So what I was going to do is say, throw medley on top of one of those floor masters and I'll immediately bomb it. But... Wait a minute. We need medley in here, so... What? Yeah, I remember this room. We're, we're just supposed to come in here for the key. That's it. Oh. So now we can leave. This switch won't stay down. Want medley to stand on it? T Tingle, you can shut up. Yeah, we're just supposed to have this key for this door over here. Also, I think there might be something on this side of the, the big face. Maybe it's just skulls? Yeah, it's just skulls. Tingle would say something otherwise. Okay, more more purple choo-choo's in this room. Okay. Uh, I believe, if I recall this room correctly, this is the room that you need to... Yeah, okay, you got it. This room is actually pretty cool, because they utilize the purple choo-choo's in an interesting way. Um, they become weights for buttons. Yeah, so they'll spawn over here. Maybe. There it is. And purple choo-choo's don't jump, right? Um, I don't think I don't they do. Think so. Oh, wait, no, they do. They do. Yeah, there he goes. Oops. Nice. Okay. So, yeah, we can use them as weighted um, weighted weights, and we can hold down the switches for the, the staircase up there. Don't see a staircase? Well, it's about to materialize in just a second. There's one. No, you stay here. That was kind of funny. And drop it. Now, like I said, if I'm not talking as much as I normally do in episodes, that's because my throat is threatening to turn sore, so... Believe me, pal, you're doing just fine. Yeah, I don't feel like it. Choo-choo's are honestly pretty harmless. Yeah, they are. They don't really do anything. Oh, we lost the we lost the stairs. That's what this is for. Yeah, I know. I just say. I thought I thought you placing those choo-choo's there would actually hold it down. Because they're partially in the light, but I guess not. They're barely in the light. Okay, stupid floor master. I'm gonna get my my body on him. As soon as he materializes, I'll bomb him. Oh. Oh, he's invulnerable during that. Got it. Good. Did you see that? I hate those guys. Did you just use arrows? Yes. Nice. Yeah, floor masters are the worst. Like, they were bad in other Zelda games, but in this one, they just... They got a facelift, and they're much, much more terrifying. Um, they're not more terrifying than wall masters in Ocarina of Time. That was the stuff of nightmares. I think that they're more terrifying just because they're more effective. Okay, uh, you want to know what to do? Push um, that crate. There's a switch. If you push that crate, it'll go oh. on the switch and it'll open the open the shutter. You know what this ga this dungeon reminds me a lot of? Hmm. The kingdom, the castle of Ikana in Majora's Mask. There's some kind of mark here. Thank you, Tickle. But yeah, it really does, because that's the that's the dungeon that you get the mirror shield in. Oops. And you use it a lot. So that's pretty... Also, that's the, that's the game that introduced the uh, light weakness to Rededs, I think. Unless Ocarina of Time had it. Now, is it that in, is it in that game that the shining light at, at Rededs caused them to dance, or is that a mask? That was either a mask or a song. Up higher. I think it was a mask. 
Yeah, I think you're right. Shining light on wouldn't make sense. And then they had like the they had the Russian folk dance and the the I think one of them did the moonwalk too. Yeah, Majora's Mask is great. I need to play it sometime. Ugh, come on. There we go. There we go. Good job. I don't know why Link couldn't just push it. You know? Yeah. If it's destroyed by light, how heavy can it be? Also, if he can lift those gigantic headstones, then why is this stopping him? You know? What does Tingle have to say about that? Uh... It's some sort of giant pot. It happens if you climb in- or what happens if you climb inside. Everything Tingle says is kind of mysterious. Uh, there's a treasure right here. Where? Right here. Oh, yeah. I think that will appear in a second. Okay. Um, you know what? Um. Really? Nailed it. Why does it show her as taking damage? Like, she doesn't, she doesn't have a health bar. I don't know. And Tingle says there's some sort of mark here. There we go. Good job. If I recall, this is something useless like the compass or something. I think it's the compass. Hey, the compass can be handy. Not if you know the dungeon by the, like, the back of your hand. Which I clearly do, by the way. Like, I know this game more than anyone in the world Earth. Like, I, I called that it was the compass. Which is why we referenced the book and the map before recording. Yeah, but not in this case. Link, do not worry about straying far from Medley in the depths of the temple. It's not like I just told you at the beginning of the episode to protect her. Just relax and open your dungeon map. As long as you have the compass, you can easily confirm her whereabouts. Am I the only Zelda fan that wants a replica of the Gossip Stone? It's so pretty. It is kind of pretty. I would want it with, like, a, the guts of a speakerphone in it, so that yeah. you could get calls and it would vibrate. That'd be, that'd be pretty funny. Okay, no, let's see. no, it could be a Bluetooth speaker. Ooh, that would be even cooler. Oh, okay, hi. Uh, I'm thinking we can finish this room and then call it. I don't want episodes to be too long, especially when they don't have to be. So go ahead and just clear this room out as quick as you can. You know what? Like that. Oh! Whoa. I was <laughs> just like, catch. Go away, man. Aw, oh, man. Come on. Just kill him. Why is he still alive? Because Link can't aim. <laughs> oh, actually, actually, wait, wait. Try this. Try this. This this is really cool. What? You hit him with ice, I blow him up. Ooh, okay. Try it. Uh. Just shoot it. That guy. Go. I think it worked. Did it? Did it? No, I missed him. Okay, ready? You locked onto him? Yeah. Go. Yeah, it worked. Sweet. That's a cool combo, combo actually. Combo. Okay, I cannot hurt those guys, so why are you trying? I don't know. Okay, so those are, uh, those are posts, the introduction of a new enemy, that you cannot not hurt them unless they have been solidified, and you can only solidify them if you hit them with light. So, or, or you can let them possess you, and then when they unpossess you, they've materialized. Yeah, that works too, that's an easy way to do it. That's um, actually the hard way. I think it's uh, honestly easier. It takes longer. Less effort though. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to solidify them here. Now, if they do possess you, um, your controls will be reversed for like 10 seconds or something, and then they'll just go away. They're cute. They are kind of cute. Okay, go ahead and end, and good. And now that Medley's there, she can she can stay there and be a source of light. Nice. They're cute. Oh, I should have seen what, what Tingle says about them. Yeah. Man. You should have. That's fine. I'll you get another failed. chance. Uh, there's a treasure up here. Do we really need it, though? Yes. Okay. Oops. Also, I love how there are emblems of Medley's, uh, Medley's instrument all over the pedestal there, saying, like, idiot, shine light here. Yeah. Is this me, or is, is Medley's design just really cool? Her character design? Yeah. Yeah, it is. 
I mean, she doesn't really have much character development. I mean, she has more than other characters in games, but still, her design is pretty sweet looking. And she can fly, so that's cool. Yeah, it is pretty cool. And she has weaknesses to that flying, so it almost seems like she's, you know, she's growing and advancing. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's look at uh, time here. Um, yeah, I think we could call it. I don't want to go too much further. All yeah, right. This is a perfect spot too, because look up there. Yeah, and and we've got we've made some pretty sizable progress. So next time, I should be a little bit over the weather. Over the weather? <laughs> I should be over the weather, and Nova will be too, because she wasn't feeling too peachy either. So hopefully that will be a thing. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like. And if you didn't, drop a comment telling me how I could make the next episode <laughs> so that you would like it. <laughs> Medley's going to continue to stare longingly into your soul, and I'll see you guys next time for another Pals Play Wind Waker. Episodes are released Tuesdays and Fridays. Oh! Oh, just barely. I didn't know you could do that. That's cool.